Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with a five-box random team football mixer. Random team break number one. And a chance to win one of our superb owl mixer spots. Excellent. That's pretty awesome. Um, so, but here, are the, we've got to do these first. So we'll randomize your names, randomize the teams, put them all together here. Then at the end of the break, we'll re-randomize different dice roll. Put your names back in there again and see who wins that $500 mixer spot. Pretty crazy. All right. This is for the names and teams first. Let's randomize each list two and a three, five times. Your names first. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. We got Eric Eifland down to Eric Eifland. And five time for the teams. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. After five times, we've got the Jaguars and the Falcons. Cat down to a bird. All right, so Eric with the Jags. Sean with the Buccaneers, last spot mojo. Anthony with the Lions, Will with the Cowboys, Jared with the Bengals, Sean with the Browns, Jared K with the Eagles, Brian with the Titans, Eric with the Jets, Sean with the Vikings, David with the Rams, Jared with the Chiefs, Sean with the Saints, Jeremy with the Cardinals, Bills uh, for Chris Miller, Will, Bills, then to Will, Packers, Nicholas Kasberg with the Redskins, Jerry, you got the Dolphins, Jeremy with the Broncos, Sean with the New York Football Giants, Shane with the Pats, Sean with the Chargers, Jared with the Seahawks, Karen with the Texans, Derek with the Niners, Sean with the Ravens, Jeremy Graham with the Colts, Mark Passmore with the Steelers, Chris Callantine with my Raiders, Sean with the Bears, Jess with the Panthers, and Eric with the Falcons. All right, so feel free to trade if you'd like. Here are the boxes right here. Just keep those years in mind. And a chance at a Superb Owl mixer spot. Have we trademarked Superb Owl yet? That's, people have called it Superb Owl for a little while, I think. I don't think we're the first ones. But we could be the first ones to trademark it, Andrew. Good call. Maybe we should. All right, any trades? What's up, Greg? What's going on? We should trademark. No, no trades. I know, I know we've been having a little bit of some lag issues. So I mean, I'll give it a few more moments. Although I'm watching myself on the stream right now, it seems to be working fine. I'm going to wave. See how long it takes me. One, 1,000. Two, 1,000. There you go. And I waved. So I'm not lagging behind. Yet. <laughs> Denver for the Vikings, maybe? I'm not sure if Jerry is here. Blurry picture, though, says Brian Crouch. Are you watching at 720p? Sometimes YouTube will automatically adjust your settings to a lower quality. If you hit the little gear button next to your window resize buttons, there's a little gear. Click that and then hit quality and hit 720p. YouTube had actually automatically set me at 480. Come on, YouTube. Our internet connection can definitely handle 720. All right. Well, sorry, Jeremy. Looks like looks like nothing there. Sorry. I don't know if Sean is here right now. Sean with the Vikings. All right. Well, let's get a move on. Trade window closed. We can, we're, we've got a lot of breaks backed up, so let's hustle with this one. I think I estimated this break to be much longer than I thought it would be. <laughs> so we may have some additional time. We'll find out after this break. Or no, maybe I got maybe I got it 
spot on. Anyhow, let's find out after this break. All right, here we go. There's the official printout right there. Five box mixer, random team one. Good luck, boys and girls. And we'll randomize this at the end of the break. I'll leave it right here to remind me. Uh, let's start with this right here. Some old, uh, totally certified football. Is that the oldest thing we have here? No, let's, this is the oldest thing. 2013 absolute football. Start with that. Bust out these McDonald's apple pie boxes. Still have not treated myself to an apple pie yet. Maybe tonight. How often did anyone, anyone know, anyone who maybe you or yourself have worked at McDonald's? Do they bake those fresh like throughout the day? Or do they bake them once in the morning and then, and then that's it? Is it the morning where I should get the McDonald's apple pie? When's the best time to get a apple pie from McDonald's? If one were so inclined. Gino Smith to 199. And we've got Nice triple relic right here. 46 out of 99. Gavin Escobar, Joseph Randall, and Terrence Williams. All right, nice. Rex saying five left in Series 1. That'll break tomorrow. Very excited about that. Out of time tonight, though, I'm afraid. And there's Adrian Peterson, Boss Hawks 99. Ray, what's going on? You just watched the second break of Limited, and the Jamon Moore auto was behind his helmet. I'm confused. How is that possible? I don't think it was. All right, and we got Demontre Moore, Spectrum Silver Autographs. Demontre, everyone remembers where he goes, right? Back in 2013. Goes to the New York Football Giants back in 2013. I knew that. I totally knew that. Whoa, 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 Andrew, the, the apple pie boxes have the time of baking written on them? That's a game chart. I didn't realize that. All right, so that goes to Sean. I know it's expired, but you may be able to get something in return from Panini. Just ask them. They're pretty good about that. Huh, Jarrett noticed it too. JMS saying Panini removed some of the ink on the helmet? Maybe we'll, I'll take a look after this break. Out of 25, Rex Burkhead. And rookie premier materials, Cordell Patterson. 13 out of 49. Triple relic and autograph for the Vikings. Sean Cole with that. We'll see Cordell Patterson with the Patriots this Sunday. Isn't that crazy? And there's his rookie auto. What if he becomes... Super Bowl MVP. Maybe a good time to get that that RPA then. All 
Oh, I see. Just to clarify, it's a time they expire, not when they're big. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. But still, that's hel that's helpful information, Andrew. Helpful apple pie information. All right, and there's Latavius Murray out of 499, who's a current Viking. There's a former Viking. And here's a current Viking, but this card will still go to my Raiders. Chris Callantine with the Raiders. He and uh, Cordell Patterson were teammates for a season, I think. Somehow Panini knew that would happen. All right, so there you go. That was 2013 Absolute Football. The next year is, the next oldest, is 2014 Totally Certified. Have a large box for just these four packs. We got Kadeem Carey, totally certified. Rookie roll call relic for Sean and the Bears. Nice, and she's like, 16 years ago I worked there, and that's what he remembered. All right, well, this is valuable information if you want to raise your pie game. Out of 100, Alan Hearns, Jarvis Landry, and Kyle Van Oy. Nice Kyle Van Oy, rookie autograph for the Lions. That'll be for Anthony P. Paul Hutchins says maybe a $25 break credit and an apple pie promo. That'd be good. I could I could go with that. Although someone might someone may not receive their their winnings, their apple pie winnings. Dear Joe, I never got my apple pie. I thought that was part of the promo. I'd <laughs> be like, I don't know what happened to it. Matt Schaub. And we got a Luke Wilson. I don't know Luke Wilson is playing football. That goes to the Seahawks. That'll be for Jared. I want a Luke Wilson, Owen Wilson dual autograph. All right, next one. Oh, come on. That, that makes too much sense, Mark. A McDonald's gift card. Don't you want, like, a three-day-old apple pie sent to you in the mail? And there's Jamal Charles, clear cloth. Nice, it's clear. There's the cloth, 11 out of 50. It's a cool one for the Chiefs. Jared with that one as well. <laughs> Just send him a $2.22 gift card. <laughs> and, like, you have to buy an apple pie with it. All right, let's move on to 2017, and then we'll do Ultimate Draft, and then we'll close out with the, uh, with the jersey back there. Ship cards in an apple pie box. I could just make an apple pie. I make a pretty good apple pie. I can just make them. Alright, Peter, what's going on? Now, uh, some people in the, in, the, in the world have suggested that there are other flavors of apple pie that are available, or other flavors of apple pie, <laughs> other flavors of McDonald's pie that are available in different flavors, depending on what part of the country you're in. Does, does anyone have unique flavors at their local McDonald's? 
outside of the standard Apple. There's Quincy Wilson, 41 out of 50. I feel like all the, all the local McDonald's here, I feel like it's all just, uh, it's all just Apple. Didn't they used to do cherry? Yeah, hang in there, Peter. That's Khalil Mack. Apparently Khalil Mack and John Gruden have made up. Or at least are on the same page. Wish that would have happened last summer. 60 out of 199. Davis Webb, patch and autograph for the New York Football Giants. That'll be for Sean Cole. Right, what? Wait, 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 you have strawberry cream? No, I uh, haven't seen any Eagles in this mixer, Peter. There's Eli Manning. Charles Harris to 199. Was there cherry back in the 70s? Andy says he'd rather have a cherry turnover from Arby's. Man, they turned my local Arby's in Santa Monica into a Wendy's, which was disappointing. Todd Gurley, fabric of the game. Nice, 48 out of 99 on that one. That's kind of cool. So Ray, Ray M is saying at least in his part of Texas, they have strawberry cream at the McDonald's. Gurley goes to uh, David Bruins. Wait, Andy, your Wendy's turned into an Arby's? I think they, they own each other, right? One company owns the other. So I guess they just thought a Wendy's would work better. I don't know. Uh, out of 299, that's Joe Mixon, new generation relic for the Bengals. That'll be for Jared, Jared S. Your KFC turned into a curry. How the there was a KFC near near me, near Santa Monica College, that turned into a drive-through Starbucks. It's lame. Ray Lewis. Not that I eat KFC all that much, but if I wanted to, the choice is gone. I want to eat some of their extra crispy. Maybe uh, get some of their sugar coleslaw. Their very sugary coleslaw, which is delicious. Oh, it's we're having the buffering issue again. Not sure what that is. It must be something to do with the YouTube server. Seems okay. Seems okay on my end. All right. 2018 Ultimate Football. Leaf Ultimate Draft Football. Good luck, everybody. These guys are in their college uniforms, right? Yeah. Got to be YouTube doing on your p phone and PS4. Yeah, we've been kind of dealing with this for a couple nights now. Sorry, folks. Hang in there. Got to tough it out. There's Durham Smythe, who I believe is a dolphin. Dolphin. Well, YouTube hasn't hasn't really said anything because I think we may be having a somewhat isolated issue. Could be like a particular server that we're on. I'm not sure, but there's Kenny Hill. I don't remember where Kenny Hill goes. Yeah. 
Kenny Hill is undrafted in the CFL? Was he associated with any team? Oh, he signed a contract with the Oakland Raiders. So we'll we'll send CFL Kenny Hill to the Oakland Raiders. So that'll be for Chris Callantine. Ian Thomas, 17 out of 25 autograph. Oh, Fortnite streamers are having issues too? Okay, so it's not just us then. Well, good. I was a little, I was a little concerned that it was just us. Then it'd be like... Kind of a, it takes a while to figure out how to troubleshoot that. Uh, that we that we disabled. Paul Hutchins, we did disable the um, the DVR function because now if everything if YouTube's running smoothly, then it would only be then our our lag time without the DVR function would be much shorter. So so which is a good thing. There's Michael Gallup. I know where he goes. Dallas Cowboys. So the Ian Thomas goes to the Panthers. Jess Fox, that's for you. Michael Gallup is going to gallop to Will Comstock, Bulldog fan, with that one. And last but not least, bada boom, three out of ten, Baker Mayfield. Nice. All right. Oh, other breakers are having this issue too, Ghost Razor. All right. So it's nice to, not just us then. Nice Baker Mayfield for the Browns. Sean Cole. That is strong. I think that's the frustrating thing because it buffers for a minute or so, Andrew, and then it'll then it'll be back to normal for like 20 minutes and then... All right, well, at least it's not just us. All right, TriStar Hidden Treasures Game Day Greats Autograph Football Jerseys. You can get these guys, which is really cool. If it happens to be a college jersey, ladies and gentlemen, it'll go to the, uh, the team that that player is currently on. Or the t if he's a retired player of the team, he played for the longest. Or, I mean, other breakers. It can't be other breakers. We're the, we're the only ones that do this. This whole thing. Good call, Andrew. Nice. Yeah, well, other breakers. We're the only ones that do this. We're the only ones. Ah, now for America's favorite game. Hopefully, everyone. I think we're we're the stream is catching up just in time for America's favorite game. Huh. This usually goes to this team, but this guy is going to this team. How long did he play for that team? Oh, for a decent amount of time. Oh, okay. All right. Who am I? I'm a seven-time Pro Bowler, a first, a four-time first-team All-Pro. I was an AP NFL Most Valuable Player, a three-time NFL Passing Touchdown Leader, and, a, and this particular year, NFL Passer Rating Leader. I'm in this team's Ring of Honor. This number is retired. I'm also in this team's Hall of Fame. And I'm in the Pro Football Hall of Fame. All right. Joe Montana, good guess. But now, here's the twist. I was born in 1926. In 1971, I was inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame. I was the 1963 AP NFL Most Valuable Player. 1963 NFL passer rating leader. I died in October 18th, 2017, very recently. My number 14 is retired by the New York Football Giants, but this jersey doesn't go to the New York Football Giants. I'm part of this team's Hall of Fame. That's where this team goes. There you go. Smacky's got it. Yep, Newman. Yep. Y A Tittle. 
in his red Niners jersey. We usually see him. There he is. We usually see him in uh in like New York Football Giants gear. But he did play for the Niners, San Francisco Niners, from 1951 to 1960, a good chunk of time. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Why a tittle. Uh, 18th. Add a one to that, Andrew. That's that's when he passed. And there you have it. That goes to Derek P. and the San Francisco Football Niners. There you have it, folks. Five box, random team break in the books. Now it's time to give away... A $500 mixer spot in our 101 box Superb Owl Mixer. Let's see who's going to be a Superb Owl. Everybody has a shot at that spot, from Jeremy down to Nicholas and everybody in between. So here's, let's get him into a new blank list. New dice roll. Four and a four, eight the hard way. Good luck, everybody. Four and a four, eight the hard way. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Name on top after eight times. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Two, and Sean Cole. Congrats to Sean. After eight times, you are right there. You, thanks to the five box random team mixer, you've got a superb owl mixer spot. 101 boxes, and you're guaranteed a random prize as well at the end of the break, including the hits. We only have three more spots left, and they're locked away in those 2016 NT NFL breaks. In fact, we're doing one of those uh, a little bit later tonight. So we only have two more spots left. So check out the website for all the details jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the net. Wait, Andrew's saying Wikipedia has his death. I'm sure I'm sure that's a typo by TriStar then. I'll side with Wikipedia. Sorry, TriStar. Anyhow, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.